Hey guys, ready to game here and welcome to another Minecraft video. So, by the look of my spawn, you should understand what today I'm going to be discussing about. Yes, it is related to Redstone, but I'm not going to teach you a full tutorial on it. And by the way, this is a how-to series continuation. And today, actually, I'm going to show you guys how to make a really, really fast clock. Now, the, in older versions, this doesn't work, and in new versions, it works. So, all you need is a redstone torch. Any block of your choice that can that you can put a redstone torch on, redstone dust. And now, I'm going to show you another two clocks, and that's the older version, which it works. You're going to need one repeater, and redstone, and redstone torch. You're fine. The old version is like, you put down a repeater like that, you put down a repeater like that, put down four redstone pieces and then you put the tick one each and you place a torch and delete it as soon as possible and it runs at that low speed now this is the old clock and I, to show the speed I'm just going to take a piston and you can I just connect it yeah you can see that speed that's the speed of the uh, older versions so now I'm going to show you the latest version, which is very ex extremely fast and you can use for many purposes like TNT cannons, you can use it for dispensers, shooting arrows, you can use it for many things. Okay, so um, all you want to do is make a structure like this 3x3, three three. it can be larger but the maximum minimum is 3x3, three three. you can put 3 torches at the back. Uh, redstone which is not normal torches and then what you want to do is you are going to place uh, three redstone pieces on the other side where the torches is now what's happening is that this torch is powering this block which powers this redstone which powers this which powers this which uh, denies this which denies this which owns this which powers that and it just goes in a cycle like that now that is uh, if by the look that is faster than that definitely and let's test it out by putting a piston and look at the difference obviously that is slow now let's just uh, do a test if we kind of change the tick only in one will it be the same so we need extremely fast hands for this why is not it work um, Oh, I place it in the books. Okay, there we go. There we go. One tick. Okay. Look, it doesn't work. So the fastest you can go is actually um, this in the older versions. In 1.5.2 and above, I think this works. So you can just go ahead, build this. You can use it for shooting arrows, for example, like this. I'll take our stack. And if you want to shoot things like that, you're going to need a dispenser, obviously. And I can just place that there. Place a target in front of it so that you can see how rapidly it shoots. Let's keep a piston in the middle. So it's fancy. Fancy. Okay. Look at that. Look at that speed. Look at that determination. Just look at that. That's extremely faster than that. Okay, um, I wish I could conduct a test like which could go faster. And it already finished a stack. That is quick. As you can see, it finished one stack within a few seconds. Okay, let's just stand in there. Slash game mode zero for the intro. Outro. Out, 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 out. Half a heart, half a heart. Okay. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and please like if you did and cover in arrows. Don't they look fancy? You fancy people are covered in arrows. If you don't know, check out the newspaper, read it daily. It's good. And if you like this video, please subscribe and like and also share this on YouTube and Twitter if you like it. And see you guys later. Take care.